Hi everyone and welcome to my channel or welcome back if you've been here before. My name is Charmaine and I like to talk about books, do subscription unboxings, and pretty much just have a good time. If you're in for any of that and you feel like hanging out, please consider subscribing to my channel. That's awesome of you if you do. Please like, comment, subscribe, share, all of that fun stuff that we like to do on YouTube. So today I'm going over a book unhauling for the first time ever. These are some books that I have like honestly been holding on to and I think it's just because I like collecting books. Like if you guys look behind me, you can really tell that I'm like quite a collector. And some of them I don't read, some of them I collect because they're pretty, some of them I collect just because I needed like another f like book to grab at the thrift store so I could get one for free, that kind of thing. So these are the books that I'm going to be unhauling towards my thrift store so that somebody else can hopefully buy them and enjoy them. I'm going to let you guys know what they are. I've never done this before, so I might be like a little weird, but I don't know like how else to do this. So these are the books that I'm not going to be reading. I'm, I'll give you guys a reason like why I'm getting rid of them, but I think it's just time. I mean, if you just watched like last week, I just brought like home three new series that I'm actually looking forward to watching. So there's no point in keeping ones that I'm not going to read. And I have a lot in this room that I could get rid of. So I might end up with like a lot of unhauling videos and then hopefully a lot of hauling videos as well, because if you get rid of some, you get to buy some more. <laughs> That's my plan anyway. <laughs> okay, so the first book I'm getting rid of here is Andam, or er, wow, that's not what it is. <laughs> it's Tandem by Anna Jars Jarsben? Jarsba? Okay, I'm not going to be able to say that. I thought that this would be a really good book. I don't think that there's anything happening with this series. It was supposed to be a series and it looked like the first book got made and maybe the second one but now there's not going to be a third one from like the thing that I read. So there's no point in keeping it because it's going to be an incomplete series and I'm not going to read it. Another one here is Possession by Elena Johnson. I 100% bought this because of the cover. I thought the butterfly in the ice cube was cute. I have no interest in reading this anymore. I don't even know what it's about. There's no point. James Patterson, The Sixth Target. I will probably not ever read a James Patterson book. I'm more into like YA fantasy and stuff like that. And it's not that he's not a good writer because like I know a lot of people like his books. I just don't have any interest in it. So why am I keeping it? This is Lauren Conrad, The Fame Game. It's the girl from the hills. She was famous or is famous, I guess. So like, I don't really know because I never saw The Hills. But I think this got gifted to me by somebody and it's just again like not something that I'm really interested in so I just don't see the point in keeping it. I think if I'm doing an unhauling video I probably don't need to tell you guys that I'm not going to be keeping these books the entire time. But I do feel as though I'm going to say it every time because you guys know that's how your girl rolls. I like to mess around. I like to say things over and over again. I like to mispronounce all of the good stuff. <laughs> like, I mean at least you guys are here for it and thanks for spending your day with me you know. So the next one here is Dangerous Lies by Be Becca Fitzpatrick. Okay, this book is bumpy. I don't know if you guys can see it. I don't know if it's going to catch up in the camera or what, but it's like rain on here. And this one, I'm actually having a hard time because I kind of want to keep it, but I don't really know if I'm interested in it. I'm going to set it to the side for now. We'll just set that one to the side for now. Another one that we have here is Charlie Presumed Dead by Anna health still health still curiosity is a killer it says so this is a thriller and i am kind of like getting into thrillers a little bit right now i just don't know if i would read it that yeah that's pretty much all these is you guys so this one is i swear by lane davis i really like the cover again i just don't think i'm ever gonna read it a racing time by cj hill I also really like the cover. Like you can tell when I pick up books from the bookstore, like my thrift store or like my bookstore, that like half of them I buy because they have cool covers. Like I buy them because of the covers. This one's bumpy, you know? <laughs> like, so again, I'm just not gonna read it. And this one is slated by Terry Terry. <laughs> Cute, her name is Terry Terry. So yeah, I just, it does sound good. Like, Kayla's memory has been erased, her personality wiped blank, her past has lost forever. She has been slated. 
The government is giving her a second chance as long as she plays by their rules. But with no memory of her crime or previous life, how does she know who she can trust? So it does sound like a good book. Maybe I'll set it to the side. I just don't know if I'm going to read it. But it kind of, like, maybe I will. I don't know. I'm going to set it to the side. Okay, so, so far that's seven. The last one I have here is Cold Kiss, and it's by Amy Garvey. And it says, be careful. Danny was mine. I was his. And that wasn't going to work if he was dead. What you? So I would make him not dead. Not anymore. Wish for. This was my first mistake, but it also turned out to be my biggest. I think it's kind of like, this might be actually a YA fantasy for all I know. Because it does have like Lauren Cates, like the, the person who's talking about like the book, like do doing the, I don't know, promoting kind of, I don't know what they call this. Is that like a tagline? No, I don't think so. What do they call that? Do you guys know? Anyways, so Laurie and Kate is like a YA fantasy kind of author. So this might be like that. I just don't think I'm going to read it. That's, but I do love the cover. That's definitely why I picked this book originally is because I love the cover. Like the majority of the reason why I picked these books originally is because of the cover. I think this one was gifted to me. I'm pretty sure that this one was gifted to me because I would not like read James Patterson in my own mind. But yeah, so... That's it. Okay, so I'm getting rid of those eight and I'm going to keep these two for a couple more months and then if I end up reading them, I will read them and keep them, I guess, or give them away at that point. But if I haven't read them by February, I'm getting rid of them. That's my plan. So I'm going to end up having a couple more unhauling books. This was just like my first kind of like figuring out how to do this. And even if this is good, like I kind of went through everything fast. I didn't really read anything to you guys. Like, do you like this kind of video? I don't know. I'm just trying to get rid of some books because I just got a whole bunch in and I kind of need some shelf space. Like I honestly either have to buy a new shelf so that I have more shelf space or else I have to get rid of some books. So I'm going with the getting rid of some books because I don't have enough shelf space like to area in this room to put another shelf. And I'm in like the second biggest bedroom in this house. So I really need to get rid of some of them instead of buying more or at least trade them out. Bring in the new ones, take out the old ones. That's a good plan. <laughs> Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. Please like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends. I know I say it at the beginning, but I'm saying it at the end as well because that's how I like to live it. I really appreciate your guys' time. Thank you so much for your minutes. I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.